What to do when you finally receive your Torrance TD124? Don't start using it. Why? Because the Torrance E50 motor of your turntable is at least 50 years old. That means that it will show every sign of the wear and tear of old age. The motor shaft will show friction marks in the places where it touches the sintered bearings. Sintered bearings are, quotation marks, self-greasing. Perhaps I should say they were self-greasing. Nothing lasts forever, nor do the sintered bearings or the greasing pads of an E50 motor. They will wear and they will dry out. In the long term, applying a drop of oil will not do. So if you start using your TD124 as is, you will notice that it can take a very long time for the platter to reach the correct and stable speed. Furthermore, you increase the chance of a total loss of your wonderful turntable. And this is all due to the large amount of friction in the unrevised motor. Eventually, it can overheat and finally it will probably get stuck. End of story. In this video we will show you the difference between an unrevised Torrance E50 motor and one that has received a major overhaul from Hansa Hi-Fi. The left motor is unrevised. After power is switched off it will spin for about 10 seconds. Mind you, this specific motor has been greased to prevent it from overheating but it's not okay. After power is switched off from the second motor, it continues spinning freely for at least 50 seconds. This motor was fitted with the Shopper E50 motor revision kit, which comprises new sintered bearings, new greasing pads, new bowl and thrust plate. Hansa Hi-Fi takes care of polishing and precision fitting of the motor shaft into the new sintered bearings. Furthermore, we centered the rotor exactly. I will now switch off the motors. And as you can see, the unrevised motor has already stopped revolving, whereas the revised one is still making its rounds. So, once again, be sensible, don't be fooled by a seller's smooth talk that the motor runs fine, because it doesn't.